hi hello everyone welcome back to my channel my name is professor JK and today in this video I'm gonna show you how to bypass a nightcloud locked iPhone as you can see I do have an iPhone and this is an iPhone 5s and the iPhone is locked is iCloud locked so today together we're gonna we're gonna try and I'm gonna show you how to bypass a night cloud with my iPhone 5s and let's go as I said that we're gonna try to bypass together this iPhone but for that we're gonna need some tools the tools that will help us to bypass the iPhone and we're gonna need a mic book we're gonna need a Microsoft which will, which is running a Microsoft Windows we're gonna need an iPhone the iPhone the one that is locked we're gonna need a jailbreak tool like check rain we're gonna need also a bypass tool like FRP the one for FRP so you're gonna find everything down there so for that let's go as I said before bypassing we need to jailbreak and for that we're gonna use check rain we open the check rain you're gonna check our check rain the iPhone is iPhone 5s the check rain is the version of check rain is 10.10.2 and the iPhone the iOS that we're gonna try to bypass is iOS 12.4.8 so for that we need to go to next and we need to wait and next so the iPhone will restart in recovery mode and check let's check to guarantee you can see the iPhone is in recovery mode so you click next again but before to click start you need also to check start so then the, you can put the iPhone in TFU mode but don't forget to read we're gonna find some step they, they will show you which step to do so then you can put your iPhone in DFU mode so just try also to read the instructions there now we are waiting for our jailbreak to finish and the jailbreak for those who doesn't know the mean for those who don't know I mean the meaning of jailbreak jailbreak is just to get an administrator access of your iPhone so then we can we can we can bypass the iCloud and we need to wait as you can see everything is fine if you do have a problem if you do have a problem with your jailbreak you can just write me and then I will show you how to do it or how to solve it please use Microsoft Web or Catalina sometimes with iSierra you you may have problems now you can see the jailbreak is done so let's go and try to bypass as I said to bypass we're gonna use Microsoft Windows so let's change and get Microsoft Windows welcome we are on Microsoft Windows as you can see we are on Microsoft Windows we're gonna try to jailbreak a to bypass I mean because we yeah to bypass as you can see let's open let's go and let's go and see there is bypass iCloud we open you can see the version is version 2.3 and also the iOS is 10.4.8 just for you you need to connect your your iPhone and click bypass and click start bypass and wait you can see in process in process iCloud bypass or in process bypass iCloud I mean so we need to wait wait a little bit we need to wait again until when it yeah there we go bypass iCloud done so once the bypass is done you need to go back go back again you start over again next again so you're gonna see up there there is next but before we we couldn't we couldn't see that next but now we do have next so it means that everything is fine the bypass is fine so let's click on next 
continue without Wi-Fi, use Wi-Fi, just continue without Wi-Fi, you can connect later to Wi-Fi. I wanted just to show you that everything is fine. And let's try to let's try to set up our um, new iPhone. So uh, I'm gonna I will just leave some steps, the one that we can finish even later with the setup. So let's just ignore some other stuff and let's go. Let's go and see. Uh, yeah, everything as you can see, everything is fine. Everything is fine, everything is going fine. Welcome to iPhone, get started. As you can see, is a new iPhone, everything is fine. No more that thing of byte or iCloud, what what everything is fine. Is a new iPhone, so you can use the iPhone, it's fine. And let's try, let's see if we can put a SIM card. Yeah, let's try and get a SIM card. In my case, I use MTN. Yeah, I use MTN. Okay, and let's see if the SIM card is working. Yeah, as you can see, the update, the SIM card is working. You can see already the icon for LTE long term evolution you can see so everything is fine thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe don't forget also to comment don't forget also to like also to share the video thank you thank you and see you next time bye bye